Welcome everybody to another video and UGC Limiteds are actually here. As you can see, there are tons and tons of new UGC Limiteds that are out. This is just absolute chaos. Rollymons has now added a UGC Limiteds tab on their website. And yeah, this is just absolute chaos. I know when UGC Limiteds were leaked, they said that like an average of 100 of these could be uploaded per day. And that is exactly what happened. I did the math and so far 118 of these UGC Limiteds have dropped just on the first day. And it's only been like, I think at the time we're recording this, like only 6 or 7 hours since the UGC Limiteds have been out. And we already have over 100 of these things out, which is honestly not good because this honestly means that we'll probably see like hundreds of UGC Limiteds per day, which... I feel is way too many, but I don't know. UGC Limiteds are definitely very unique. I've got a lot of stuff to talk about and like the different features they have compared to normal Limiteds. And I actually bought one of them. This was the first one to be announced. It was the Type Dummies Golden Hair, and this was for 5,000. It did sell out, and now it's in that holding period. That is just like the other three uh, Limited 2.0s that we saw, which I guess the Limited 2.0s are now seen as like testing items and they kind of use like test items as those items as well like they use like the test hat and stuff so i guess those are now just that those were tests of ugc limiteds and yeah it's, it's official these things are now out so the main thing about ugc limiteds is first thing they're just like limited use in the sense that they come out with a limited quantity and you can see like all these different ones have like different prices and different quantities uh there were even some free items that came out uh if we look Maybe here, I think this was a free one, like f 10 free eggs, I guess. Wabbit's Easter egg. Uh, there was another coin or something. Um, down here, yeah, the Who's coin, 10,000 quantity, free price. Uh, there were a few items like this too, one quantity and the price was 5,000. I believe Lonnie actually got this one, so he has a one of one limited, which is kind of interesting. But yeah, these things are wild, man. Like we have a, a pickle, as a as a UGC limited, we have the pink troll face, a chicken, rainbow Michael, whatever that is. Like these things are crazy. Um, and an another thing about UGC limiteds is they are not tradable, which I'm very thankful because if we were having like hundreds of UGC limiteds come out per week or even per day, and they were tradable, like the trading market would be absolutely destroyed. Like Roblox trading would genuinely be destroyed but i think because they are not tradable i actually don't think these will affect trading at all like this is like a whole separate market it's not really limiteds they're like their own special type of limiteds so honestly i don't think trading is going to be affected at all by this but i also don't think that these ugc limiteds are good at all so the problem starts with the transaction of the percentages that are given out to like the different parties in this whole transaction. So first thing, the creator of the item will get 30%, which makes sense. And then the seller or distributor of the item only gets 40%. That's crazy. So, and then the platform like Roblox gets 30%. So just like any other limited, there was a 30% tax. And now there's an additional 30% tax that goes to the UGC creator. So 30% to Roblox, 30% to the UGC creator, and only 40% to the actual person who buys the item. That is, that is so bad. Like, when you sold limiteds, it would be, you get 70%. But now you only get 40%. Like, that's almost half of that. Like, if you have a 1,000 Robux item, and like you couldn't even sell it for double the amount and even make profit you would have to sell it for like almost triple the amount to make any profit which is honestly just crazy and that is the biggest issue with these ugc limiteds because you're basically not gonna make profit it's just kind of how it is and honestly i don't see the point in buying these like there's just a bunch of like spammed items coming out and they're honestly just they're just bad like, they're honestly just awful. Like, I mean, some of them are cool because they have, you know, some of them are free. So, they will be, like, free Robux, which is, that's kind of cool. Um, and, like, there's some with, like, low quantity, which I suppose that's cool. And there is there is some cool items in here in general. 
I mean, you got like some crowns. Uh, this thing is really cool. I, I love this item, the banana boba tea cap. I think that's very creative. Like, you'll get some good limiteds in here. And maybe if you're a collector of like other UGC items, this will probably be cool. But if you're looking to profit, this is honestly not the place to do that because these are just simply not going to be good. But honestly, UGC limiteds are more of a collectible thing and less of a profitable thing. But you guys let me know in the comment section down below what you think about all these UGC limiteds. And honestly, it'll be fun to kind of see, you know, all the new stuff that comes out each day. Like, we've already got some wild stuff out here already. And uh, yeah, honestly, you know, as a content creator, it's kind of cool to see all this stuff. So I'm definitely excited, don't get me wrong. Like, I'm, I know I'm kind of hating on the UGC limiteds a little bit just because they're kind of, you know, not profitable. But it is still cool nonetheless. And uh, yeah, sorry I didn't stream when these actually came out. I was actually at a track meet, and uh, I'm actually going to be at a track meet in St. Louis for the next couple of days, so yeah, this kind of happened at like the worst time possible. But I want to get this video out to you guys quick, you know, show you guys all this stuff and give you guys my opinion on it. But if you would like to buy these UGC limiteds as they come out, or at least monitor the UGC items, I would recommend going on the Rollymon's website here and check out this UGC limiteds page and they'll be updating like all the new UGC limiteds as they come out. So honestly, it's a nice spot to just kind of see all these different crazy items that come out as time goes by. So that is gonna be, okay, three, two, one. So that is gonna be the end of this video and hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll keep you guys updated on this crazy UGC limited stuff. If anything special happens or something comes out that I wanna make a video on, I will let you guys know. But yeah, this stuff is, is crazy. You know, it's a great addition but it is absolute chaos, and we'll see what this chaos brings, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.